Learn how to make objects magically disappear with just one click in Adobe Photoshop. Let's check it out. Okay, here we are in Photoshop and I have nine different artboards with nine different photographs on them. Over, to your, over here to the right, I have my layers. I have everything on its own layer. Now you have to have the layer that you're working with has to be active. So I'm gonna start out with this very top one and I'm gonna do zoom in, which is command plus. And I'm gonna look at this guy jumping off a cliff up here at the top right. Now what you do is you select the layer then you use the lasso tool so that's L for the keyboard shortcut, or just come over here to your toolbar and click Lasso Tool and draw a selection around the object that you want to make disappear. And as soon as you do that, all you do is go Edit Fill, which the keyboard shortcut is Shift F5. And it gives you this dialog box open that says Fill. Make sure that the content is set to Content Aware. And here comes your one button click. You just hit OK and the object that you had selected disappears. Now what it does is Photoshop samples all the pixels around your selection, and then it fills in uh, that selection with those pixels. So it works really good for objects that have the same colors of pixels around them. So let's look at this uh, dog right here on this uh, soccer field here. So I'm gonna highlight the layer, make sure it's active. Lasso tool, draw around the dog. I'm gonna hit Shift F5 to make this come up and I'm going to hit OK and it's going to sample the pixels and then fill in. Now the keyboard shortcut to deselect is Command D. So now that I've deselected you can see that there is some blurry pixels here where it didn't do great. Now you can go through and clean this up a little bit better but for a one button click you know this is amazing what Photoshop can do. So let's look at this car right here and we have the car and we're going to draw pixels around the car. We'll do edit, feel, content aware, okay, car is gone. So like I said, it works really good when the pixels are similar. Now let me show you one uh, picture right here where it does not work so well. So here is just a picture of some people and here's a guy playing the bagpipes right here. Now I'm gonna do a selection around this gentleman and try to make him disappear but there's lots of pixel colors going on around here. We've got people, you got everything in the background. So this is where it's not gonna work so good. So if I do edit, fill, and I do content aware, it's gonna sample the pixels around him and then it's gonna fill in. Now you can see that did not do what we wanted to. So there are limitations to using the content aware fill. So if you have more complex things, you're gonna have to go to recreate in the background with the clone stamp tool. But for just one click, easy, magically making things disappear. Edit, fill, content aware will do the job.